All right, so here I have an Amazon box. And inside we have another box. So I've kind of already opened this. Well, kind of just to see what it was. So, and inside we have this case. This is a biological microscope with, and this is the instruction manual here in the little plastic um, front cover thing. And it's in a nice little carrying case. So we're gonna go ahead and open this up. Um, and I got this really for my kids. They're starting to explore and like to look into things and see what they're made of and what makes up particular items. And so this is basically a nice microscope where they can pick apart things and look at different layers of things. And um, it really allows their imagination to um, explore not just what they see, but what's deep down inside something or made up of something. What something made up of. <sighs> Goodness gracious. It's really packed in here. This is a nice foam pieces cut specifically for the item. But, I mean, that's a decent size microscope. This is the um, focusing knob here. And then you've got different zoom lenses here, 40 times, four times, and 10 times, it looks like. And then this is where you put your little slides. Then this um, is where the light comes out so you can see up through the slide. And it looks like we've got, oh goodness, some tools in here. We've got like a little petri dish that you can look at things. We've got some gauze. Looks like some little labels. We've got some slides. I believe these already have some things on them. Yeah, so these are already pre-made up slides which has things on them that the kids can look at. So this one says that it's an onion epidermis. So that's a very thin layer of an onion. So that's kind of cool. So anyway, we're just gonna take this out, kind of have a little science lesson, so to speak, at home. Um, I really enjoyed science and lab time in school, so it's really hoping this is something that we could do and have fun at, you know. Uh, these are just blank slides, so this is where you can create your own. If you want to take something and make a slide and figure out what makes up the layers. Got a little bit of oil that you're going to put on your specimen and then so just some different forceps and tools. This little pick and a little thing to just get at different layers of items sharp nice little curved scissors got a little pipette a little tube this is a little knife box knife kind of razor knife razor knife uh, this is part of the microscope it's just another foot that I think suctions down. And take a look at the instructions on that, what it's used for. Got some smaller glass, these are glass covers, those go over your little um, slides. And then we've got an instruction manual in here. So that's all I'm gonna go through through here. Put all this stuff back in here. There's also a little, it's like a power cord or some type of cord here. We'll figure out how that goes and plays into everything. Oops. And again, nice little plastic case. Oops, I forgot the Petri dish and stuff. Let's get this. Ooh. 
Okay, we've got some other lenses here. I think these are for the eye socket lenses. This is a two times zoom. I want to be careful bringing these out of here. This is a WF 10 times zoom. Wide, I think that's wide focus. I'm not really sure. Here's a WF 25 times. And there's something in here. This is the power cord for the micro, uh, microscope. Wall plug. And then, looks like we've got a lot more slides in here. And again, all of these are already pre-done. And if you can look at uh, basically all different kinds of things, letter E, corn pollen, pepper, epidermal, daphnia, leaf of hydrania, uh, tilia, stem, sapphire, powder. So all different kinds of things that you can look at. It's already on the slide, so it just gives you something to for the kids to explore. So... Uh, we'll get this set up and let the kids take a look at it, and we'll let you know what we think, um, how easy the focuses um, are, and how easy the kids can use it, and if we have any difficulty. I'm having difficulty putting the slides back in here. So that's kind of cool. Lots of pre-made slides that allow you just to go ahead and take a look at some things. So... Anyway, uh, thanks for watching and hopefully you enjoyed this video.